Arrow's the story of a young female superhero in Shanghai. She's got the power to fly, manipulate the air. She can create hurricanes of great force, walls of wind, air blades, bubbles to take her on adventures at the bottom of the ocean. In these first 12 issues, we follow her as these mysterious jade towers begin to pop up all over Shanghai and they're protected by an army of crystal-like monsters. The presence is the driving mystery of this book, and the answers to the secret history behind them come from the mysterious Madame Huang, who will prove to be both a mentor and an adversary. We wanted to make sure that this was a modern take on the origin of the character. When we were searching for creators, uh, Zhao Lifan and Kang came in, and we knew it would be the perfect fit in what we were trying to accomplish. Zhao and Kang bring a regional authenticity that we simply couldn't get in tone or art with anyone else. With the story, you really get into the head of the character, and the art is absolutely stunning. In her civilian identity, Arrow's a very successful and famous architect. So she's not a down and out Peter Parker type, but she's deeply insecure and to some extent naive. She overextends herself to her disadvantage. So like any Marvel character, she's relatable with these very human traits. The creators kept in mind that the greatest of heroes is only defined by the best of villains. And it's the villains and the powers that they bestowed upon these villains and their intentions, be they evil or not, that force them up against Arrow that make this book so exciting. Arrow's got beautiful art, a really unique character, some crazy villains, and a story that introduces you to a new and interesting part of the Marvel Universe.